Hi everyone and welcome back to another day of vlogmas. So as you can see I'm in my Christmas PJs. I'm feeling so festive this year. I'm not even joking you. Usually I don't really get excited for Christmas like the order I've got but now I've got a baby I feel like such a kid again. I'm so excited. This video about what I bought Delilah for Christmas has been so highly requested. When Christmas comes she will be almost seven months so at this moment in time she's six months but on the 25th of December it's like a week until she's seven months so before I do get into this video I don't want people to think that I'm bragging or anything like that because recently I have had the odd comment of people saying that and I'm just not so many people have asked me what I bought Delilah so this is it this video is basically me showing you guys what I bought Delilah for Christmas obviously I know she's still a baby and I know people are going to be like, oh, she's a baby, she won't remember it, but that's fair enough, but I will, and it's my first Christmas with my baby girl, and I'm so excited. Normally, I don't actually get excited for Christmas anymore, the older that I've got, but now I've got a baby, I just feel like a big kid again. So, if you do have any other video ideas or anything that you would like me to film, please comment down below, and I will be sure to film them. Throughout the video, I will try my best to let you all know where everything is from and how much things were, but other than that, let's get started. So the first thing that I got Delilah was this stocking. This is from the range and it says baby's first Christmas on it. And it's pink and it's got a cute little elephant on the front. Me and Lorenzo have stockings but for some reason I don't actually know where they are. So we might need to purchase some for me and him as well. But this is Delilah's stocking. And then the next thing that I got from the range was this like huge stocking which I'll put some of her presents in. And yet again it says baby's first Christmas on it and it matches the little stocking. The next thing that I got was quite a practical present um we more than likely might use this before christmas because whenever i bath delilah she has one of them seats where she lies down and she actually doesn't she started to not like baths and she used to love them so i'm going to give it give this a go so this is basically a seat that you put in the bath so that they can sit upright delilah can now sit upright and not fall over not 100 percent. she still has the old time where she does wobble over but i feel like she'll really like this so this was from Smith's and I think it was like £15. Um, I'm not 100% sure but it was about £15 or £20. And then the next thing that I got was this baby TV. This was from B&M. Um, I think... I'm pretty certain that this was part of the 2 for 20 range at B&M. So I think I got four things from B&M which was like part of that. I can't... If I'm being honest I don't actually remember. And you just twist it like that. Wait, I might even turn it on. And then it moves. <laughs> the first time that I played it to her to see if she'd like it, she just burst out crying. So hopefully she does like it. And then the next thing from B&M, this sensory ball. It's got these like textured bits and this was £5. I think this would be really good for a kind of development of like holding things because it is a giant, it's called a giant sensory ball. So I think this would be great for her development. And then I got these mini sensory balls from the range. These have different textures and patterns on them. I also got these hide and squeak eggs. The eggs which you basically can take apart and they make noises and stuff like that. So <laughs> I got these eggs. And then me and Lily went to London not so long ago. So I got this royal family book and it's got the queen on it. Because I think Delilah's only going to know a king now. Which I think is absolutely crazy. So it's a little book about the royal family. Obviously for children. I bought that book from Hamleys in London. I got her these bows from TK Maxx. The velvet. You got a brown one, pink one and a like beigey goldy one. It looks a bit white on camera but it's like a golden tone. And I thought these would be beautiful for around Christmas time. Boxing day. We've got my dad's birthday. So yeah. Got a lot of celebrations and these will be perfect. This next thing I know she's going to absolutely love. At the minute she loves looking at things that move. I don't know what it is. She's clearly just fascinated by it. So they're these sensory balls. They're called sensory glitter balls. And I got them from Play Empire. Now I will link these down below in the description box. And you just shake them and just look. Even I love them. And they're so Christmassy as well. So I know Delilah is going to be obsessed with them. She has been playing with them already. I won't lie. Just because I know how much she will love them. Now. This beautiful. <laughs> annoying toy. 
from B&M. This was 12 99 but it was also packed two for £20 range. So, yeah, again. <laughs> it's so annoying. But I know she'll love it. And then I got her this My First Library little book set from TK Maxx. Um, you get three books in it. One says big and small, the next is counting, and the one is first words. Obviously, she's not going to be able to use these until she's like, I don't even know what age, but obviously not at six, seven months. But yeah, I've got her these for the future anyway. And then the next thing that I got her was also from B&M, and this was also part of the £2 for £20 range, and it's this piano. Um, it doesn't make a noise, so I need to change the batteries. But yeah, yet again, good for a development, and I'm assuming it will make some noise. And then finally, moving on to Smiths. I know the bath seat was from Smiths, but I've got a bag full of things from Smiths as well. And I also got this picnic set from Smiths as well. So it it literally it does talk to you, I think. Triangles as watermelon! Yay! Yay! Triangles as watermelon! I thought this was really cute. So like I mentioned at the start, Delilah is starting to not like her baths. So I thought that this bath fun play pack might help. So you just get loads of different toys and cups and stuff like that. Um, because the other week when she was screaming when we put her in the bath, she would like, I gave her some little rubber toys and then she just calmed down. So I think this will really, really help. And this was from Smith's. I'm not too sure how much this was. But yeah, again, I know she'll love it. And then I got these soft blocks also from Smith's. You can use these in the bath, you can use them out of the bath. And they've just got little like sea creatures on them. I'm not even joking, recently she just started grabbing for everything, <laughs> literally everything. And she's got a slight obsession with my phone, which I know isn't good, but <laughs> it is what it is. And then I got this sensory book and it makes this noise. It's actually quite soothing, isn't it? But yeah, Lily bought her something off the TikTok shop which was sounded like this and she's obsessed with it so I had to grab her this. And then I got her this tambourine and maracas gift set which yeah again makes lots of noise and she, she like I said just then she loves grabbing and she loves shaky things so yeah. <laughs> and then this is the next thing that I got her. It's called Take Along the Tunes and... How do you stop it? I don't think you can stop it. Oh. Oh. Oh my god, how do you stop it? <laughs> how do you stop it? I'm just gonna have to let it play. Oh yeah, like I said, she loves that like crackly sound. So I got this toy, and I love this so much because she can actually teeth on it as well. She could teeth on the drop's feet, and she is teething quite a lot. She's got them two front bottom teeth at the minute, so this is like a rattle, but also a teether thing as well. And then finally, Freddy the Firefly high chair toy. It's got like a suction thing at the at the bottom, so it can stick on the high chair. And it rattles, she could touch it, she could play with it, she could spin it. Works a treat. I recently did post over on my social media um, Delilah's new high chair, which my grandma and granddad have very kindly bought Delilah for Christmas. But obviously she's received it now because she needs it. Like, she's on solids and stuff like that. So, so many of you guys have been asking to see it and you've been asking where it's from. So it is from Cotsworld, I think it's called, but I'll show you the high chair now because that is a Christmas present from my grandma and granddad and it is so nice. I'll show you now. These are the legs, They're like a black wood with gold little detailing. Also, I just realized I've not took those stickers off. And then it's just like this. And that is really, this part is so easy to wipe clean as well because it's like a faux leather and it's quilted so it's comfortable and it's just so nice and it goes really well with like our kitchen as well which I love. I more than likely will be buying her some clothes for when she's older 
obviously at the minute she's in six to nine months but she's just growing so fast so i know that i need to buy in advance so if that is another video that you'd like to see of like a clothing haul for baby girls then please let me know and that is something that i will do i really want to go to primark because primark have some unreal bits for babies even adults at the minute so let me know if you want to see that but that is everything that i have bought my six month old baby girl delilah for christmas i hope that you've all enjoyed make sure that you do smash a massive thumbs up if you did and please subscribe if you haven't already because it means the world to me and let me know in the comments what other videos you would like to see for vlogmas or anything to do with babies christmas you name it and i'll happily do it thank you all so 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 much for watching and i'll see you in another video tomorrow